The difference between inductors and ferrite beads. Inductors and ferrite beads are often used in circuit design. They are both magnetic components. Today we will talk about the difference between inductors and ferrite beads. First of all, from the perspective of the principle of composition, an inductor is actually a wire wound around a magnetic core in circles, which constitutes an inductor, while a ferrite bead is a magnetic material of ferrite wrapped around the outside of the wire, which constitutes a ferrite bead. Secondly, the key parameters are different. When choosing an inductor, generally look at how many mu h the inductance value is, and then the rated current of the inductor. When choosing a ferrite bead, mainly look at how many ohms the ferrite bead is under 100 MHz conditions. The commonly used ferrite bead is 120 ohms, and then look at the rated current that can flow through the ferrite bead. You can take a look at the impedance curve of the ferrite bead. The impedance Z of the ferrite bead is equal to R plus JX. R is resistance and X is reactance. For example, when a 100 MHz signal passes through a ferrite bead, its impedance is 120 ohms. Thirdly, the working principles are different. The inductor is an energy storage device. It can store the electrical energy on the inductor into the magnetic field of the magnetic core and release it at an appropriate time, while the ferrite bead consumes high-frequency signals flowing through it in the form of heat energy. At this time, the ferrite bead is equivalent to a resistor for high-frequency signals. Fourthly, their circuit symbols are different. Inductors mainly have these two circuit symbols on the left, and ferrite beads have these two circuit symbols on the right. The position number of the inductor generally starts with L, and the position number of the ferrite bead generally starts with FB. Fifthly, different application circuits. Inductors are generally used in power supply or signal energy storage filtering circuits, such as commonly used buck power supply circuits and boost power supply circuits. This is an LC low-pass filtering circuit. Ferrite beads are generally used in digital chips or radio frequency chips. In part of power supply, it is used to absorb high-frequency noise on power supply. For example, commonly used digital chip phase-locked loop power supply will add a ferrite bead and need to be equipped with capacitor. If digital ground and analog ground on PCB are separated, they can generally be connected together with a ferrite bead.